Okay, it's day three of construction. Marcel and I have been to the market to buy groceries for lunch. We feed the crew every day. We give them a snack in the afternoon. And uh, I guess that runs us about a thousand pesos a day for our crew. Not much. So let's see what they've got going here. I have a pile of dirt here we're going to get rid of. And they've cut a hole in the fence here. We're going to just uh, shovel the dirt over into that empty lot over there. And get rid of it that way. So they're taking up this old concrete pad here. There's a big piece of rebar that's pointed at the tip. Oh, I'm digging out a footer in the back there. And they're making progress. Got a four man crew. We got another man on the way. He's just going to handle the dirt today. That's going to be his main task is to get all this dirt out of our way. This is more of day three construction. We've gotten a lot of the dirt moved out of the way. We're going to have to move some more. They're starting the back wall here. Gonna put some block, concrete block up there. And if you've ever seen my videos before, this is how they mix concrete here in the Philippines. They just pile all the sand and gravel and the cement and mix and mix it together on the ground. And they make a bowl out of it and they'll fill that in with water and then mix that with a, with a shovel. No wheelbarrow, no tubs for mixing, no no special equipment. So we've added some gravel, we're going to mix it in with the shovel. So you can see they wear t-shirts on their heads. Apparently that's for protection from the sun. Sometimes they carry sacks of cement and they just want something on top of their head because they'll balance it on their head. You ready? Uh, sit up. Okay. Okay. So we've gotten the garden hose out. And we're getting ready to mix the concrete. So they've added their water and now the mixing begins.
Okay, so we're continuing day three. We need some supplies. We came here to the, the Cocoa Construction Supply Company, and we're gonna get some two by two pieces of cocoa lumber, 10 feet long, and they're about a dollar and 60 cents a piece. And we got their own sawmill over here. I've seen one of my previous videos. We'll go back over here. And there's a planer and there's the sawmill. You see all the safety equipment. Yeah. So we're also getting some door jams, pre-cut door jams, and some cement here at Kogon Lumber Supply, construction supply. And this guy is one of my subscribers. And we'll get him on here. Say hello to everybody at Tito Jeff's Live. Yeah, yeah, it's Hi. Hi. All right. Okay, day three is done, and we have made more progress. So you can see we're going to have a little room here. There's one door, a second door, and this will be the door to the bathroom. It's going to be a just a small bathroom. This will be a laundry room, only four feet deep. So we've got the back wall started. This wall is a little farther up. We got the footer poured, looks like, all the way around. And we went to buy some lumber, and tomorrow we'll frame these up with uh, wood and pour concrete in the posts. And I uh, bought some door jams. They're going to hand make the doors. And then What else did we get? I had to buy some cement today, cocoa lumber for the for the post frames. Uh, we've got some lumber that I bought by mistake, some pine. We're going to use that in making the doors. Um, so we got we got some work done today. I had to stop and talk about it a little bit, figure out what supplies I needed. So I went also and I bought some plumbing materials. Um, and what else? Well, that's it. Day three, we're making progress. We'll see you again tomorrow.